हेलो एवरी वन सो वी विल कंटिन्यू अर पाइस पार्क ट्यूटोरियल एंड इन दिस पर्टिकुलर वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू सी अबाउट द विंडोज फंक्शन इन अ पाइस पार्क इट इज अ वेरी मच इंपॉर्टेंट टॉपिक एंड द यूजफुल टॉपिक सो वी शुड नो अबाउट द विंडोज फंक्शन इन अ सिक्वल ऑल्सो वी यूज अ डिफरेंट विंडोज फंक्शन लाइक रो नंबर रैंक डेंस रैंक लैग लीड इन अ पाइस पार्क ऑल्सो वी कैन यूज द सेम वन सो दैट एक्चुअली वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस लाइक हाउ एक्चुअली वी कैन यूज द सेम रो नंबर रैंक डेंस रैंक लैग लीड इन अ पाइस पार्क दैट वी आर गोइंग टू सी so if i show you in a sql how actually we use uh, row number so we write a query like this select row number and after that if you had to group by any column then we write partition by and if you had to order based on the certain column then we write order by salary and uh, we create a new column right rn or something name you can give and based on that we try to filter so the use case is like suppose suppose i had to find out the fourth highest salary so in this case what i will do i'll use a row number i will assign a rank based on their salary based on the descending order of the salary now you can see based on their descending order of the salary i assign the rank who is the top top is a 40000 in highest salary so i, I assign a rank 1 who is the second so 34000 so for this i assign a rank 2 so like that based on the their salary order i assign a rank so if anyone is saying like to find out the fifth highest salary so then what i will do select up from this table where row number equal to the 5 so this row number column we have to derive so how actually we can derive with the help of this query actually we can derive this uh, row number and the rank and then if anyone is asking like to find out the fourth highest salary then we will do select up from table where row number equal to the 4 then you will get the fourth highest salary if anyone is saying like to find out the second highest salary then what we will do select up from table where row number equal to true then we will get the second highest salary so this is the very useful case which generally get so there are different use case like we have a row number rank and dance rank so based on the use case actually we use suppose you have a duplicate scenario so in this duplicate scenario we use a dance rank and the rank concept so you can see 20000 and the 20000 so in the if you use a row number then it will assign a all the number in a sequential manner you can see both the 20000 are the same salary right but it assign the rank 3 and the 4 randomly but when you will use a dense rank and if any duplicate value is there so for the duplicate value 20000 it will assign the same rank you can see it assign the same rank 3 and 3 and after that fourth is coming and then fifth is coming but when you will use a rank it will assign the same rank for the 20000 you can see uh, it assigned the 3 and 3 after that the fourth rank should come right but fourth it will skip because the we have a duplicate entry we have a duplicate record so it will assign the same rank and then it will skip the four and it will directly assign the five and then the six so these are the different use case we have in that case we use a different kind of the windows function like row number rank dance rank we also have a lag so if you have to suppose find out the previous value then we use a lag if you have to find out the next value then we use a lead function so these are the different windows functions are available in a sql and in a pyspark also so let us see how actually we can use in a pyspark so let me open my databricks you can see i have a one data so this is the data i have with this data and the column i have created one data frame df now in this data frame suppose you have to use a row number based on their country and based on their high based on their salary and the country you have to assign a rank in a sql we use a row number rights in pyspark let us see how actually we can do that so for that first you have to import one library from pyspark dot sql dot window import window after that we have to write we will define one parameter you can give any name i am giving this name as a window we have imported this right so we will use this window dot partition by so based on which particular column we want to partition so i want to partition based on the country so i will write partition by and the country so based on the country i want to partition so i will write window dot partition by country dot order by b will be the capital based on the salary so i will write the salary by default if you are not mentioning the ascending descending so it will be ascending only so what actually i am writing window dot partition by country and order by salary so in a sql also if you will see we write like this right partition by column name and the order by so here also we have written in the same window dot partition by column name and order by salary 
now we have we also had to use a row number right so after that what we will use in a df we are creating a new column so we'll write df dot with column and i will give the name as a rn we are going to use a row number so i will use a row number and dot over and you have to pass the this window with whatever you have defined so i'll write the window here over window now if i'll do the dot so you will see one rank new column got created and this new column based on their country we are grouping based on the country right so you you can see you can uk and based on their ascending order the salary one rank got assigned 5000 is lowest salary so it assigned the rank 1 25000 is second salary so it assigned the rank 2 similarly for the india what is the lowest salary 2000 so it assigned rank 1 then we have a 10000 so it assigned rank 2 then we have a 50000 so it assigned rank 3 so like that actually we can use that so suppose you had to use a rank so what actually you can do you had to use the same only what we can do instead of the row number you can use the rank if i'll use the rank now if i'll show you so you can see uk 5000 25000 And for the India, we have a two thousand, ten thousand, and fifty thousand. It has some. We don't have any duplicate record, right? For the India, so that is why it is giving the one, two, three only. And suppose you have to use a dense rank, then instead of rank, you can mention the dense rank. Dense rank, it will work. Only the use case we have to remember where we have to use a row number, where we have to use a rank, where we have to use a dense rank, and the syntax. What what we have to do? First, we have to import from PySpark dot SQL dot window. We have to import window, and what we will do based on which particular column you have to group. So we want to partition based on the country. So what I have written window dot partition by country column, and based on which particular column I want to sort. So I will write dot order by salary, and uh, we want to create a new column, right? Where all the rank will be defined, so that's why I am using a with column. I am giving the name as R N. If we have to use a row number, then you use a row number dot over, and this window you can pass here, and dot so if you will do, it will come. Now suppose you have to do based on the descending order. So in this case, what you can do, you will use the same syntax, and uh, we will use a C O L function also. So that we have to import. So what we will use. from pyspark dot sql dot functions import col now in this case what we can do if we can pass col here and you can write descending you can close this now if i will execute you can see based on their descending order it is assigning rank so in a uk what is the highest salary 25000 right so it assigned rank 1 then the 5000 assigned rank 2 in india what is the highest salary 50000 so it assigned rank 1 in india then 10000 then it's assigned rank 2 so like that we it, it will do now suppose i want to make a duplicate record let's make a duplicate records so for india what i will do this is the 10000 salary right so what i will do i will make the same kind of the salary so let me make this also 10000 now let me execute now let me show you the scenario for the rank and the dense rank so if i will use the row number first so this is the row number if i will use a row number here you can see it is assigning a this is the 10000 10000 but it is assigning a rank 1 2 it is a duplicate record but also it is assigning a rank 1 2 in the case of the row number but if i will use a, a rank here now if i will execute you can see india india both salary is 10000 right then it assigning a for the same salary it is assigning a rank 1 after that two should come right but directly it is coming three because we are using a rank now if i will use a dense rank here you can see for 10000 and 10000 it assign a rank 1 and then it is assigning a next salary into the rank 2 
so that is the use case we have so like this actually we can use a different windows function so i hope you got the idea yeah that's it in this show try to do practice because once you will do practice then you will get idea more